three, two, one. We're live on that one. Hey, welcome to Thirsty Thursdays. Thirsty Thursday. This one's a special episode, number yeah. 15. Yeah, we're we're trying something new here. Yeah, for sure. I'm just going to jack it off really quick. I'll be right back. Oh, man. Run my leg. Got a little fire. Oh, this is starting off. <laughs> It's almost <laughs> as if you're live and nothing's going on. Oh, look at that. There's a layer up there. Okay, so yeah, we're trying something new here. We're going to go live for we're, the first time. We're not live on YouTube. We're live on Instagram. So if anybody's watching on Instagram right now, we'll give you a shout, or shout out to us in the comments. And then I'm going to go check every now and then. Every couple minutes, I'll yeah, just we'll take a look. Yeah, we'll see if there's anything going on there. Nobody's probably watching anything. Yeah, it's, it's kind of nice. It's, it's us. Nobody's you know watching who, <laughs> You know who is watching. Maybe not live, but... Uh, my buddy Josh Walder told me that Rocco wants the links from you. Know, he's liking what we're doing here. We're on the fence about even stopping what we're doing, but we're close. So I say, well, if you're gonna get the links on the Max Four page and this and that, we better interview some more artists. So stay tuned. A little bit so. later here, we're gonna interview a, one of my favorites, Sequel. We're gonna call him up here. That's why we got the laptop here. Uh, we don't want to restart the computer. No, you might want to postpone that. And um, obviously this whole video on YouTube that you're going to be watching now, it's unedited. I'm not going to edit anything, so whatever can go wrong will go wrong. <laughs> and so before we call sequel, let's do what we always do this time. And if nobody knows us that's watching on Instagram right now, this yeah. is R2K. No. He's a rapper. Uh, Apparently he's a rapper. <laughs> this is my brother. <laughs> Robert's the man good. behind the scenes with the beats. And yeah, his music will come out eventually. Yeah, it's coming. It's coming. Uh, now you threw me off topic. Hashtag Triple T. This is what we do here. It's called the Thursday. Same time every, every week. Thursday taste test. And so for anybody that is tuning in on Instagram, what we do is bring in unique drinks. Unique. It's not necessarily beer all the time, but just unique taste alcohol tests. taste tests. And we re review it and give you the thumbs up or thumbs down. It's one of those... What was that? Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah, it's mostly. So we'll try this out. There. And this one's pretty unique. I've never had it. It's called the Hobgoblin oh, Beer. How appropriate for the fall and yeah. Halloween coming Halloween's up in October. October. It's a little ways away yet. Oh, Goblin. Well, Book your Halloween parties today. You don't need the chase right there. So, Hob Hobgoblin. Hobgoblin, what do we got here? Yeah. Traditionally crafted legendary ruby beer. Not promoted by Mad Child. <laughs> you see the goblin? Yeah, there you go. Brewed with the roast, what does it say? Brewed with roasted malts for a well-balanced, rich, smooth taste full of mischievous character. We'll just see how mischievous this is. It's from London, is. England. All you guys at home, crack a beer, join us. Yeah, or a drink or whatever good. you're drinking. I know Logan, you're having your chocolate milk. Yeah, there you go. Cheers to Thirsty and Thursday. Let's check it out. That's full, not bad. Full body. That is. It's a little Ooh. bite. Give it a thumbs up! Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just start doing that for an hour. Just... <laughs> You're on the fence? No, that's pretty good. It's uh, I wouldn't drink a whole lot of them. It's, it's was that strong? What that's, is this? That's why they put it individual cans. Yeah. <laughs> but four and a half. Yeah. Not bad. It's not strong. Right? They're all put together, and it has R2K's <clears throat> picture right on it. It's, Yo. <laughs> it's a hobgoblin. Mm. So, other than that, we've been uh, recording my stuff in here, this writing a little more. Yeah. So, we're going to give you a tour at the very end if you guys want to check that out. Too. Yeah, we'll show you around in here we'll too. We'll talk the sequel and then after that we'll finish off with a little tour of this whole facade is what we call it. It's the Battle Shack studio. Where did the name Battle Shack come from? It's from the old shack days in Cut Knife. Just down the road here in Cut Knife, yeah. We threw many a party in a shack. Just down the street, we used to party all the time. It was a great place, a lot of good memories. So it got knocked down when a new owner came in years ago, and in its memory, we built, converted this shack into the battle shack. And yeah, now we're going to try to interview more and more artists <laughs> and people doing great things in and around the hip hop community of yeah, Saskatchewan. That's so true. And also shout out, it's Pepsi, not chocolate milk this time. <laughs> so oh. Right on, Logan. Get the on. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, let's uh, let's get a sequel. Uh, yeah, sequel call here. 
Oh, I can spin that. Yep. There you um, go. We have a pivot stool. Yep. That's our bar stools. I got a big bar bench in here. You'll see that in a couple minutes too. And we're just going to ask Sequel a little bit about himself and about a show coming up that he's going to be a part of in Saskatoon at the event center. Yep. And that is uh, the Necro and Mad Child. October 21st, if I'm not mistaken. You can double check that. See, if we weren't live, then I could double check it, but. Might turn the music down. Yeah. Let's see if you'll call. I cranked it. Go ahead. If he doesn't answer, this is not. <laughs> We'll try again in a few minutes, then. Yeah. See, he's not going to see us. He's just going to see a blink. He's going to see the camera. There you go. Or you can pivot it, whatever. Yeah. In the meantime, while this just rings and rings and rings, hopefully he answers. Hobgoblin. Oh, yeah, we're drinking that. <laughs> we're drinking this now, yeah. Where's this made? It's at London, England. Oh, yeah. Oh, just like this Harry Brompton. See, I'll take my... Wookie koozie off, but Harry Brompton beer too. It's acting a little British today, I guess. I guess one thing I can mention this uh, Sunday at 2 p.m. we'll be at the skate park in North Battleford. Yeah. Having our Battle Axe meeting. And anyone wants to come out and join us, we're going to do a little skate and a little hanging out. Just do a little skateboarding. And uh, we are taking donations for a good cause this weekend for. for sure. Some kids are in need of some uh, school supplies and stuff in, out of Unity. Single mom struggling and came to us, so we're going to pitch in and try to round up a little donation. So if you come out, you bring a donation. Uh, contact any of us for a donation. We're going to donate a little bit of our money. Yeah, it doesn't have to be much, but you know, a couple if, bucks, you, you know, if you give a little couple and somebody else gives a little couple, it all adds up to something big at the end, and that's what we're aiming for. So it doesn't have to be a hundred dollars or something crazy, just 10, 15. And if 20 of us throw in 10, 15, that's, what's the math on that? I don't, I, I wasn't so paying attention to tell you the truth. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, obviously Sequel has not answered, I'll try him again. We'll give it five minutes or so. And I, I just talked to him, so you should know the call's coming. Just keep spamming him, yeah. saying it's a telemarket or something. Well, he won't answer then. Ooh. Say it's um, who's someone famous around here that can <laughs> say it's R two K. Yeah, yeah. There you go. And uh, I don't know how many people are viewing this live right now, but we got check. questions. Anyone got a question while we? Uh, we have people in and out. Mm -hmm. There's uh, yeah, a lot of battle axe guys for sure. It's a lot in this area. Mm -hmm. So shout out and make sure if all the Battle Axe guys around this area are oh, watching, yeah, right. and then uh, make sure on Sunday at uh, 2 p.m. There he goes. There he there is. Cool. Okay, just to bring you up to speed, you're sitting in between my brother and I. That's why you're not hey. seeing us. But the cameras are over there. That's why we got you. We got you pointing toward the cameras. Yeah. yeah sorry, it's gonna... Yeah. Where's the Where's the sneaker on? Let's see the bucket. Okay. Should be good like that. Now you want to say something? Alright. Say something. Where is it? Well, oh, it's over here, I think. To say test, test? You want to test, test? No. Where, Where is, is the speaker on this thing? In the bottom? I don't know. <laughs> See, I told you you should have hooked this up. We can still do that, can we? Well, that thing's not long enough. No, that, well story of your life but <laughs> oh shoot well well i'll just leave that like that we'll just yeah, see and comment if you can hear sequel or if not then we'll turn up the mic a little bit more can might get some you hear me? uh kind of <laughs> <laughs> it's not coming through the microphone though. that's the weird yeah thing. oh it is it's, it's definitely i know but from the speaker on the laptop oh yeah which is weird. It's like how it far will that thing stretch? No. Hey? Yeah, I'm gonna try and plug. I don't think that's gonna reach. That's something it comes like... all the way to this side. Yeah. Uh, let's see something here. Oh well, well, this goes. I'm just gonna improvise for one second here. <laughs> I knew 
stuff is going to be kind of quiet. Yeah, it's weird. There's no real speaker on this laptop. Oh, wait. Let's uh, say test, test one more time. Test, test. Uh, that sounds like shit, bro. Yeah, we found the speaker, but it doesn't sound that good. Uh, we're on the Richards Instagram, R2K Baxmore on Instagram. So it should be, yeah. It's a. Uh, yeah. I don't have the thing to just make this thing go even further. It should be fine. I. Well, well. He's just checking the his Instagram to see. Oh yeah, yeah. If it's well, this is not <laughs> well, trying. We're trying here. The first ever it's live stream of anything. So, eh? Yeah, sounds good. But I don't know. Can we... I don't know if we can hear you. I can hold it back. You found the speaker, though, right? Yeah, it's underneath. <laughs> <laughs> this is the first time for everything. Just put something on that side. There we go. Here's some hits. Yeah. Say check check. There, now we check. Oh, we can hear you a little better. It's better. Let's see if there's a. Uh... Yeah, he's saying what up, so see if yeah. <laughs> you guys can hear him? I don't know. Anyway! That was, that was yeah, that was him, <laughs> yeah. He's the one checking. Yeah. So, what's uh, new? What's happening? You do any touring? You just finish any touring or anything? Yeah, we were trying to organize something coming up, but I know we're all pumped up for your opening up for Necros coming through town. Yeah, man. Lots of cool shit coming through. That Necro matchup show will be fucking sick. Yeah, that'll be sweet. I'm, I'm getting my ticket. I'll be there. <laughs> always, lo always love your sets. <laughs> Thanks, man. Appreciate it. Yeah. Likewise, dude. Nah, but you... Yeah, I really like what. So, are you part of that? Uh, like, what do they got that rap battling thing going on? What's that about in Saskatoon? Mm, what rap battling? It's the underground. All right, is it was a, was it for just the summer or there's oh, the, the battlegrounds? Battleground, yeah. Yeah, I, I, I hear you. I don't do that either. That's the way I do it. Yeah, yeah, I hear you. Uh, well, we do have respect the F4 coming up, so we'll have some battles in that one. Yeah, that's, those, those are fun. Yeah, I enjoyed that. That was a pretty... Yeah, that was sweet, man. I Thanks a lot for that. That was a fun time, man. I really liked that. Work. So uh, let's let's plug your album one time. Tell everyone about it, where they can get it. Well, the last one I released was uh, this year in April. It's called Odd Man Out. The album Odd Man Out was the name of the crew that I was starting in the movement that I was starting. Um, so I wanted to make an album that really just kind of signified everything you know to do with the whole concept of really just doing your own thing, staying in your own lane, and audibly. So that one came 
Hives there. Right on. And uh, just for anybody who doesn't know, I'm SQL, C-Q-U-E-L. Yeah, man. I got a lot of new stuff coming up, too, so you'll see some of that coming early next year. Right on. I'm, I'm pumped. Yeah. I'm pumped. <laughs> Yeah, and I wouldn't, I wouldn't mind working with you on one song, maybe before I get my shit together. Maybe I'll send a beat your way. Right on. Anytime, man. Yeah, because that's that's only two. Yeah, I know, I know. I hey, summertime, I'm in construction. What can I say? You got real busy there, but things are slowing down. So yeah, no, and you. You know, too, family always comes first, so it's always trying to squeeze everything else in around that. So. But. Absolutely, man. And, you know, between family and work, and just trying to keep the music thing going, and then Man, that guy never stops touring, eh? Holy oh, God. <laughs> I know. Hey, man, he's the most successful independent hip hop artist ever. Yeah, yeah that's, that's true. He's been a long time going. Yeah, man. Uh, I also got Farside coming, next month. Uh, Jay Z's coming here October 11th, I believe it is. Um, so, yeah, man, I got tickets for all that stuff, too. So, anybody watching? Right on. Perfect. Well, I enjoy working with you, and I enjoy dancing with my wife to your groovy beats and some of your tracks. And I'm jamming out front row center at your shows, so just keep me in touch with your shows are at. I'll be there supporting it for sure, man. Yeah, right on. I'd be totally pumped for that. Yeah. All right. Well, uh, I'll get back in contact with you here again shortly about some music and. We will see you uh, at the Necro show. I don't know if I'll make the Tech Nine one, you know, family obligations, but good luck at that show. I know you'll kill it. Yeah. Right on. Yeah, thanks. We'll, we'll put all your links up below when we load this up on YouTube. So Yeah, we're going to definitely support all that. Yeah. Appreciate it, guys. Alrighty, bud. <laughs> yeah, it's something to get out of the house one night a week, eh? And do this and then maybe write some music or do something and yeah. Yeah, that's what's up. That's what it's all about, man. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Alright. Alright, buddy. Yep. Yeah. Hey, yeah, take care. Peace yeah. out, bud. Yep. Yeah. Okay, that was I'm not sure if they heard all of any of that at all, but I don't know, you got a better memory than me. Let's so, see. I do have my brain damage, you know. Well, what does that have to do with hearing? Well, I'll memorize, remembering what he just oh. said. Okay. Yeah. I do recall him saying next week, next weekend? Next Thursday. Next Thursday? Yeah. See, there you go. His memory is better than me. <laughs> Tech Nine, that's a big one. Tech Nine's sweet, man. Yeah, Chris Calico. And... Oh, yeah. So some local artists there too. So the mic. Yeah, and respect the elements, man. If you guys haven't come out to that, next time it is coming, we're gonna pump it up big time. It was a great yeah. time, very well organized, a lot of great uh, talent there. It was a really good time. So and all the people, everybody gets along very well. It's a great crowd, good people, good times. So pretty much what if you guys didn't hear sequel, I can try and tweak the volume. Uh, when I upload this on YouTube, not on Instagram, because Instagram we had it right here, but YouTube, I'll try and increase the volume, but if not, he was pretty much talking about uh, just his family life and his Odd Man Out album that came out in April. Oh, he's yes. Doing his show, like he said, next Thursday, he's going to help promote the Tech Nine and Chris Coleco. And then October 21st, it's a Saturday in Saskatoon at the old, uh, what did you say, the old Riley's building was on yeah. 33rd in Ottawa? 
Yeah, we, Saskatoon Event Center, if that's what it's yeah, called. Yeah, Sas- I think that's what they call yeah, it. Yeah, and so yeah. that one there is going to have Necro and Mad Child and sequels actually performing at that one. So yeah. huge lineup on that one, and we'll put the links below. We'll promote it next episode too. Yeah. Case. Oh yeah, you won't hear this live point. stream. You won't hear the enemy on the, <laughs> yeah. the live stream thing. We will work the kinks out. We will it'll come. Yeah. You know, uh, it'll come a little smoother every time. It'd be a little scary if this worked out too fine. Yeah. That's a little concerning. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. Just keeping it raw and real in the shack. So, with that being said, the shack, but uh, the battle shack, give you a quick tour of this place. Yeah. And uh, we'll start in one corner and just work our way around, take a peek in the booth, and uh, just give a little story about things that are yeah. popping up around yeah. here. And You've got the camera, and I will uh, move this. Well, here you can. The way. This way. So. Here, this will work for you easy. But there it is. So you just hold it like that and you point it. I'm going to take this one here. I'm just going to rip oh. this off. And then so people on YouTube can see afterwards what, uh, we're, right. what we're doing well, here. Here's the door coming in. This is a poster I got from the first place. I moved to Saskatoon away from home in high school. It's a little inspirational poster. I used to rock. All right, sorry. We got the... Uh, it's all shaky. A little bark board to keep everybody occupied. Yep. This is the bench, the bar bench we built. Oh, I'm the other way. The okay, we're, we're good. Okay, now we're good. So that's the bar bench. Bar bench is there. We got some posters on the walls, all the albums of a lot of stuff that I used to enjoy. So that far corner where it says High Street there, that's where it starts off in the years. And then it curls all the way around this way and then it goes by year all the way to the newer stuff and you see classified's newest one and then under that is where our two ks is gonna go. That's the recording studio booth there. And uh, we have uh, here, let's take this quickly. This is where I usually keep the stereo equipment stuff. Yep, sorry. Put the DJ equipment hooked up and we're not using it and we just pump the tunes there. Okay, I am getting all twisted here. Okay, you can go. That's the inside of the booth. It studio. is the inside of the booth here. If you want to get a good look of where the whole recording goes, that's chilly in here, but <laughs> it's a dead sound. There you go, so that is the Battle Shack Studio. Uh, we always keep this right above the door to remind you on your way out. And uh, thanks for all the support, guys. Yep, and we uh, we'll try this again maybe next time, we'll go a little smoother. And uh, just Keep liking and following. We're a little on the fence about keep doing it, but Rocco likes what we're doing, so we're just gonna keep doing this. And uh, we'll do maybe, because it's a little tough to get people out here to the small town of Saskatchewan for interviews, a little more video calls, interviews. So I might be calling Brothers Grimm, and I might be calling Josh, because he's so hard to get a hold of. <laughs> Even though the guy lives like right across town, he's never around. Uh, other than that, yeah. Thanks for joining Thirsty Thursdays. Hope you guys.